here we have the light combat helicopter, the prototype right in front of us. Though light in weight, this machine carries the punch of a heavy weight. The display today is being performed for you by Group Captain Hari Nair and Group Captain Bupinder Singh. This beast of a combat machine is armed to its teeth with a stunning array of weapons. A chin-mounted gun, 68mm rockets, air-to-air -air anti-tank missiles truly makes for a lethal combination. Equipped with the potential Shakti engine, this is the only combat helicopter which can take on targets in Siachen Glacier. Please notice, ladies and gentlemen, the LCH as it rapidly pulls up and see the unique ability of the rotor as the pilot will bunt the helicopter under negative G to come to hover position far away from the front ground. As you can see, this flying machine has sufficient reserve of engine power and rotor thrust. The LCH has now dived sharply and is gathering momentum to come in front of us to demonstrate sharp minimum radius turns. The light combat helicopter has made rapid strides in its development over the last few years. The sleek platform is rock steady on straight lines with minimal vibrations making it an ideal platform for weapon delivery. With the development of LCH, HAL has placed India among those very few countries that have capability to develop dedicated combat helicopters. The LCH in its design is optimized for ease of maintenance with improved reliability of all the onboard systems to keep the operating costs low. Self-reliance in such strategic machines forms an unequivocal requirement for India's defense. And products like LCH, ALH and the new baby LUH are mission in this direction. The LCH has now performed a wing over and is now positioning for two stall turns. This beauty, the light combat helicopter surely teases as it goes away. But wait, hold your breath. Speed to zero and turns with the tail rotor. That is a stall turn. Let me emphasize this is an extremely difficult maneuver to be performed by most other helicopters. Ladies and gentlemen, this aircraft has the markings of a winner as it now pulls to perform its signature maneuver one more time. The sharp rudder turn right in front of us. Ladies and gentlemen, that completes the display by the light combat helicopter. Please give it a warm round of applause as it now... Ladies and gentlemen, taking to this tie shortly will be the Dassault Rafale being flown by Captain Latigal, nicknamed Babuk of the French Air Force. A twin-engine, delta-wing, fourth-generation fighter aircraft, Rafale is a multi-role combat aircraft capable of undertaking air supremacy, interdiction, reconnaissance, and nuclear different missions simultaneously. ...a high-speed run, which will be followed by two big overs on either side.
The light utility helicopter, a three-ton helicopter with a single Ardident 1U engine, has been developed as a replacement to the Indian Armed Forces aging Chetak and Cheeta fleet of single-engine helicopters. Designing a helicopter for India's vast and varied terrain with its conflicting requirements has always been a daunting task. HAL, as always, has lived up to this challenge. This light utility helicopter, with the successful completion of hot weather, cold weather and sea level trials, can now operate from anywhere, be it the glacier or the plains, or the sandy dunes, or even the high seas. The light utility helicopter is now coming in front of us to showcase its tail rotor power and the low speed handling capability. The aircraft will perform the extreme tail up maneuver, a quick stop and the right sideward flight in that order to display its might. Ladies and gentlemen, as the LUH is performing the low speed maneuvers in front of you, I would like to draw your attention to the cabin volume of this helicopter. Despite being in the same weight class as Chetaks and Cheetahs, this LUH is a lot roomier with a cabin volume of almost 4 meter cube, capable of carrying 6 passengers. This is almost the best in the class. The display today is being performed for you by HAL Chief Test Pilot. Wing Commander Uni Pillai, along with Wing Commander Anil Bambani. The light utility helicopter has a hingeless main rotor system carrying new segmented blades, a first for HAL in its helicopter design. Segmented blades would enable rapid folding and unfolding of blades, making it handy in transport. The machine had its debut display in the last edition of Aero India over the last two years has made rapid progress in expanding its envelope of operation as you can witness right in front of you. The LUH is now performing one more stall turn in front of us. Please give her a warm round of applause welcoming her to join the ever-growing helicopter family of HAL and wishing her good luck and Godspeed. Cages of weapons. Ladies and gentlemen, the B 52 Strato Fortress.